Well, gosh, golly, it has been a long time since we've done a fun fact of Discord. It's probably because I really got stuck into doing Tumblr videos for a while. But here we go for whatever number this is, because I'm not looking at my phone to look at it, but okay, here we go. Early in its career, Electromotive Diesel was known as Electromotive Corporation. EMC's most notable achievements were and still are the E-Series passenger diesel electric locomotives. Until the E-6, each class of the E-Series was custom built for the railroad that wanted them. This example is the E-2, built in 1937 as two ABB sets. For reference, an A unit is the leading unit, which contains a cab, and B unit is a cabless booster unit controlled by the sets of A units. The recipient of the E-2 sets was none other than the Union Pacific Railroad, who used them on two named passenger trains, the City of San Francisco and City of Los Angeles. Each ABB set produced 5,400 horsepower, with a single unit producing 1,800 horsepower alone. God dang, that's a fast train. While Suteri Pratchett's 41 novel long Discworld series may be intimidating to new readers, it is not a continuous narrative, but a collection of standalone narratives that can be divided into seven different series, each with their own recurring protagonist. These being the Rincewine series, the Witches series, the Death series, the City Watch series, the Moist Von Lipwig series, the Tiffany Aching series, and the Industrial Revolution series. If only certain other shows and or book series were like that. One Piece, Bleach, Naruto, Conan. I'm looking at all of you right now and judging. October, November, and December used to be the 8th, 9th, and 10th months respectively on the old 10-month calendar that early Romans used, aligning with their root words. When Julius Caesar and Augustus Caesar came into power, they made months named after themselves and put them in the middle of the year when the calendar was remodeled into the one we have today, without changing the names of the other months. An additional fun fact, Julius and Augustus wanted their months to have the most days. It is also why February has 28 days. Well, thanks Caesar. There is a pain condition called RSD, Reflex Sympathetic Dystrophy, or CRPS, Complex Regional Pain Syndrome, or Cosalgia, that is recorded to be the world's worst pain conditions. One, the McGill Pain Chart, it stands at 45, worse than amputation of a digit or childbirth. This has no cure, no real treatment, and can affect children or adults. Often in children, when caught early, it can be cured, but if not caught early, it can be spread throughout the body. Sometimes it's caused by nerve damage type 1 or due to an injury type 2, but in rare cases there is no specification, type 3 NOS. Type 1 rarely spreads and it isn't cold or hot, a plain vanilla version. Type 2 can spread, can be hot or cold, affects the skin color, and can be an overall bother. Type 3 has no specifications. It spread, causes rashes, both hot and cold, affects how limbs work, and is the worst version as most normal treatments don't work. Studies are rarely conducted, some doctors have never heard of it, and many cases go undiagnosed. I don't have a witty comment for that, this just sounds terrifying. Lapis lazuli is usually associated with the color blue. Lapis lazuli, however, can contain pyrite or calcite, giving the blue rock a neat mixture of yellow or white, respectively. Yeah, but blue is cooler and I can use it to, like, enchant stuff, because crystals are cool. Okay. Roger Waters believes the song The Phantom of the Opera is plagiarized from Pink Floyd's Echoes, but that life's too long to bother with suing Andrew freaking Lloyd Webber. Roger, I can agree. Although, if you get the right amount of detail, you might win that case, who knows? The feet measurement was originally created and measured by the current king's foot size. Every time there was a new king, his feet would be measured and become the new official measurement for feet. After a while, this ended, and the feet measurement was set to the 12 inches we use today. Why did it end, you might ask? Well, because the people were always getting mixed up and had trouble getting accurate measurements or remembering the current king's foot size. Yeah, yeah especially back in the day where they didn't have the internet or, the, or like a faster form of news announcing. Like, hey, by the way, our new king's foot size is smaller than our last king's, so change, 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 your, change your systems, change it now, do it, do it, do it, do it. There was once a secret volcanic eruption. When Mauna Loa in Hawaii erupted in April 1942, the U.S. military told newspapers and radios not to say anything about it. The concern was that Japanese bombers could carry out nighttime raids, using light from the lava to guide them to the island. Later, when lava started to threaten the water supply for Hilo, the military tried to redirect the lava flows by 
bombing them. It didn't work, clearly. But the eruption soon ended on its own, and the water supply was safe. Wow. I'm just amazed that they tried to stop lava by blowing it up. The cartoon Phineas and Ferb, Perry the Platypus, is actually voiced by a man. D. Bradley Baker is a talented voice actor who is well known for vocalization of animals. He is also Momo from Avatar The Last Airbender. Other interesting voice actors in Phineas and Ferb include Dan Pavenmeyer and Jeff Swampy Marsh, the duo behind Phineas and Ferb. The band Love Handles lead singer Danny is voiced by the lead singer of Bowling for Soup, Jarrett Reddick, and Ryoko Nagata is Candace. If the name sounds familiar, she is also Takako Nakanishi from The Melancholy of Haruhi Suzumiya. Ah, oh, yeah, that's right. Sanic the Hedgehog's iconic shoes are based off of Michael Jackson's shoes and Santa Claus's color scheme. Way past cool, I guess? I don't know. In Super Smash Brothers and Kirby 64 The Crystal Shards, King DDD is voiced by Masahiro Sakurai, the creator of both Kirby and Super Smash Brothers. On one hand, cool. On the other hand, I get it. It was just easier to voice the characters yourself. In 1979, the horror film Phantasm was made on such a low budget that director Don Coscarelli ended up renting the camera equipment from a local rental store that was closed on weekends, taking out day rentals on a Friday to get two days worth of free filming time. Now that is how you film on a budget. Also, if you did that now, that would be ridiculous. In the Pokemon games, computer opponents will never use the same move more than three times in a row. Unless, of course, they have no other option. Roll out. This is also incorporated into the Pokemon anime. Characters only use moves up to three times in a row and constantly follow the general speech pattern, Use attack! Use attack again! Attack! One more time! Oh my god. They're right. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> this changes everything! A common Hollywood legend states that Bruce Lee's punches were so fast that they had to slow down the footage so that they looked believable. The truth is, when Bruce shot his first fight scene on the Green Hornet, his punches were so fast that they were not even caught on camera, so the studio had him hold back on his own. Only then could they slow down the footage. Bruce Lee has a power level unlike anyone on this planet. Hand ding ding finally is. In Texas Chainsaw Massacre, the 1974 version, the iconic chainsaw dance was never scripted. He was just supposed to mope around, but Gunnar Hansen thought it would be better if he threw a fit like a child who didn't get the thing it wanted. And yeah, that's terrifying. Because, God, children are terrifying, so imagine a giant one with a chainsaw throwing a hissy fit. Oh boy, am I right? Okay, bye-bye.